Like how? How did she? It's a hand painted t-shirt. Just look at it. It is my dream jacket. Hello my friends and welcome to Art Fashion Channel. I'm Daria, the artist who paints on clothes. And this is the first video of a new year, 2021. And happy new year everyone. And I want to start this year with an inspiration, with a lot of inspiration. And I want to share with you my favorite artists, clothes customizers and their most mind-blowing artworks. Uh, most of these artists, no, all of these artists are Russians because there's a huge community of uh, clothes customizers in Russia and unfortunately there is no such English-speaking community and that is the reason why I started this YouTube channel because, you know, I feel myself lucky in some way, because I'm Russian too, and even though I don't live in Russia, I am able to connect with community and, you know, exchange experience. Because you can't grow in any art as an artist without a community. Like, so many new techniques I learned from community, so many problems I solved with the help of community, so many design ideas and video ideas I got just by looking at artworks of other clothes customizers. So I want you to feel this power of community. I want you to get inspired too. So this video is gonna be very, very interesting. Let's get started. And the first artist is, uh, I'm gonna give you all the Instagram accounts of artists I'm gonna mention in this video, so feel free to follow them, to show them your love, to support community. And the first artist is, get ready to see some dope art. The first artist is Kazachenko, Natalie and her Venom hoodies. When I first saw them, I was shocked. How? How did she die this sleep? <laughs> there was just one question in my head. And there's also alien hoodie. <laughs> like, it looks so cool and creative. But I had just one question. How did she die this sleep? And I even wrote her a message. I asked her, how did she die this sleep? And she said that she hand died it. She mixed fabric paint with water and then with brush, step by step, she hand dyed the whole sleeve. And it's a lot of time and a lot of effort. And I even gave her an advice that she could dye sleeve with the help of textile dye. She could uh, dissolve textile dye in a bowl and then dip a uh, sleeve in a bowl. And then the rest of design she could hand dye again. Uh, but then she said that she feels scared, that uh, she won't have much control over textile dye, that she can accidentally dye some wrong part of the hoodie, and she feels herself more confident uh, hand dyeing with brush. Uh, but you know, if you act carefully, I don't think that there will be any problem. You can uh, dye sleeve with textile dye, and then the rest of design you can hand dye with a brush. But really, it looks so creative and so cool. Just follow follow her, show her your love. And uh, yeah, she's very dedicated to her art, clothes customizer, just bravo. <laughs> and next artist uh, is a girl with the Instagram account, Eternum Design and her Photoshop effect artworks. <laughs> when I first saw this Joker t-shirt, I was like, is it a Photoshop? Like, don't you think it looks like she just photoshopped some Joker image on a t-shirt, then she created blur effect in Photoshop? But it's not a Photoshop. It's a hand-painted t-shirt. And there's also a hoodie. Like, when I saw this hoodie, I couldn't understand, like, why did she photoshop the image on a hoodie and then she made a post like it's so strange but then i saw a process video that she uses airbrush to create this uh, blur effect these smooth transitions she uses airbrush like she makes artwork with brush and then she uses airbrush to create all these effects 
and like you know i've never used airbrush and immediately i started to google for airbrushes how can i buy them and i found an airbrush kit which was so cheap and i was so happy that i bought it for so cheap and i can create such effects too on clothes and then uh, when i received it i was like okay how will i use it and then i understood that i need a compressor which is quite expensive <laughs> and i haven't bought compressor yet uh, i hope i will soon as soon as i have money for it <laughs> because i think that every clothes customizer should have airbrush to create such interesting effects on clothes so a tandem design follow her show her your love she's amazing amazing talented artist and next artist is a girl with the instagram account artmosfera uh, and she is a guru of fan art uh, on clothes and you know i don't make often uh, fan art uh, but if you work as clothes customizer you will have to deal with uh, custom orders a lot of people will ask you to make fan art and atmosphere just amazing in it just look at her artworks on denim jackets she definitely gives people what they want and uh, this banksy jacket i'm in love with it <laughs> like she used banksy artworks but she made it in so creative way like the idea the composition details like that is parts of walls on jacket it's so cool and I, I love it and you know i had an idea to create a video to paint something in banksy style or using banksy artworks and now i definitely want to do it maybe whole outfit covered in banksy artworks yeah good idea wait for it i will definitely do it <laughs> So follow Atmosfera, show her your love, she's amazing, she's amazing. <laughs> and next artist and clothes customizer and more fan art on clothes. And if you are a K-pop fan, just get ready <laughs> because this artist makes a K-pop uh, stars portraits on clothes. And just look at her artworks. She creates such watercolor portraits on clothes and colors like details look at this artwork like the color scheme is background watercolor effect background and to make it you need to mix a uh, fabric paste with water these lights like the portrait itself is so cool like so well done and yeah i'm just speechless and this is a denim jacket she made the portrait on denim jacket <laughs> It's amazing. It's amazing. So follow her. Your Instagram account is Binishko. And if you want to get some uh, K-pop art on clothes, contact her. She accepts custom orders. And next artist and clothes customizer is Subota Nadia Art. And I want to show you just one hoodie she made. Uh, tattoo inspired art on hoodie because it's amazing. And... Uh, just look at it first of all she dyed hoodie because hoodie is, is orange and white don't know how she dyed it maybe with textile dye or maybe with spray paint i see here orange spray paint and then she created huge tattoo japanese tattoo inspired art on the back side of the hoodie and then uh, there is an artwork on the hood and do you know why I want to show you this hoodie? Because sometimes people ask me why hand paint clothes are so expensive. Like, how can it be cheap? Like, artists spend at least a week to create this hoodie. Hand dye it, then create huge artwork on the backside, then artwork on the hood, a lot of details. Like, just look how many details this artwork has. And it, it can be it's so unique and so amazing and you 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 just can't find anything like that anywhere so yeah definitely support support another art she's amazing and talented and bravo <laughs> and next artist is uh, and again i want to show you just one artwork 
she made on a wool coat. I guess it's a wool coat, I'm not sure, but uh, you know, painting wool coat is just like painting cat. <laughs> it's so hard because uh, fabric is not smooth. There's such a like little hair, so how do you call them? And yeah, it's really hard to paint on such fabric, but look at the artwork, the quality of it, the details, it looks amazing. And I've never seen anything like that in my life. Like I've never seen a more beautiful coat in my life. <laughs> it looks so cool, so amazing. So Saka Razne, super. <laughs> and next artist clothes customizer is Art Matros. And she makes amazing, amazing customized leather jackets. Just look at them. She uses a lot of techniques. She definitely uh, uses uh, spray paint, then she's splattering paint. And her favorite uh, style is graffiti style. And this jacket is so cool. Medusa and pop art background. Looks super dope. And uh, you know, I want to see more people wearing such clothes on the streets. So let's support all the artists who paint on clothes uh, because then we will be able to see more people wearing such beautiful unique clothes. And uh, by the way, soon I'm thinking to create a video how to paint on leather jacket uh, with all the tips and tricks, so stay tuned. And of course, follow Art Matros and support your amazing art. And one more amazing uh, clothes customizer who makes amazing art on clothes uh, in custom claw. I want to show you one jacket because just look at it. You know how I love to paint snakes and she placed them so interesting, like from sleeves to the back side, like <laughs> It is my dream jacket. In custom claw, you made my dream jacket. <laughs> it's super cool. I love it and support in custom claw so she can make more such amazing jackets. Next artist and clothes customizer is Dolik Art. And she's a professional artist and uh, she studied in art school in Italy. And she's an example of professional artist who paints on clothes. Just look at the level of her artworks just mind-blowing. I'm speechless. <laughs> so cool, so creative. Dolly Card is so talented, so follow her and support her. And next artist is very special for me because she inspired me to paint on clothes seven years ago. She was the first artist I saw and when I saw her artworks, I was shocked. It was like discovering new art form for me. And she had a pretty successful career in clothes customization. First, she started to paint uh, for her friends and family. Then she started to accept custom orders. And now she has her own shop with custom clothes. And when you have a successful career, you have more possibilities, of course. And she has atelier where she can make clothes for her designs. And when you are able to make clothes for designs, you can make such dress, for example. Just look at it, it's so creative and neckline was made specially for this design. So beautiful. And uh, she makes a lot of dresses. For example, this dress is simple but so cool. This dress is so beautiful, so creative. And you know, sometimes it's hard to find uh, clothes for painting, especially dresses. It's hard to find dress with the right fabric for painting. So it's my dream to have Atelier. <laughs> the Zerkovne clothes, so talented, so creative. Follow her on Instagram and support her. And you know, I have just one question in my head again. Why this art is not popular worldwide? Why I don't know any artist, not just from Russia, but from any other country who makes such amazing cool art on clothes? Or maybe there are such artists and I don't know them. Maybe you know them. If you know them, please write a comment down below because I would really love to make video clothes customizers worldwide edition. And do you know why I want to have a success in my channel? It's not about me. 
It's about art. I want this art to have a success because I think that this art is so underrated and it definitely deserves attention. Um, and it's my biggest dream to make this art popular. And to make my dream come true, please support my channel, smash that like button, subscribe to my channel if you are new here. And I hope to see you next time. Fashion is art. Bye bye.